I went to lunch with a coworker today and like any other lunch, I try to make healthy choices and this is what I chose. It's asparagus, it was grilled asparagus and it was on a bed of vegetable greens and it had um, a little tiny bit of shavings of like a Parmesan block and then it also had like some kind of nuts that were like not, they weren't like cashews, I don't know what they were, but it was really good and the bad part was that it came with bread with little butter spread, but that was good too. So I had two, like one slice of, you know, of a, of a piece of bread with some butter spread to go with it. For breakfast, I did really good though because I was able to um, get my smoothie going in the morning and I made my favorite smoothie, which is like bananas, strawberries, some cucumbers, and some blueberries mixed with um, coconut water. I start with frozen and then I start with um, room temperature coconut water and mix it together so it's like um, not a slush but a similar like really sweet type of frozen uh, drink so I really like it. So this week, the only thing that was slightly disappointing is I ate um, a little bit more meat than what I would have liked to and and or meat products, but very, very little. Like I had a couple of chicken nuggets one day and uh, today I had a small little wingding piece of uh, fried chicken. Yeah. And I'm going to go home and, and finish eating um, more raw foods tonight. So this is a new fruit that I'm trying out. It is a jackfruit. It's what they get juicy fruit. The flavor of juicy fruit from comes from this thing. And there's like pods in here, but you, the meat is the yellow part. And when I first tasted it, it has a thick texture, of course, as you see. You have to put oil on your hands, which is why my hands have a greasy look to them because I rubbed them in coconut oil first and it's actually quite tasty. It has a thick texture as you see and it actually smells and, and tastes reminiscent of juicy fruit gum. In the grocery store or the fruit market where I got this, they sell them. Um, they're huge. They, they can be like 20 something pounds so I just bought a piece. that size because I wanted to try out to see if I liked it. It has seeds in it. Let's see if this one has. Some of the seeds fell out. But it's kind of probably not supposed to look that brown. I'm just going to eat where it's yellow. <laughs> look how huge some of these pieces are inside here. It's like massive. Wow. And the reason why you put oil on your hands is because um, the, the jackfruit has natural latex in it. And when you first cut it open, it's like gooey, gooey latex all over. And if you don't have your hands greased, you're going to have a really hard time um, getting that latex off. So I was warned prior to opening and eating this, but there's no latex on here now. I don't, I don't taste anything crazy or a weird texture of gooeyness. There's like these pods. I took a little bite and there's a seed inside. See? Don't want to see. Some people dry the seeds and eat them. I'm not gonna eat the little gooey stuff out there either. But I will eat this. I just want to show you guys that even though it's brown under here, it's like just pull that flesh back, and there's these nice juicy pods. Pull it out. It's kind of rough. Gets it. Squeeze out the nut. I'm gonna rinse this out a little. I'm going to open it. You see the little brown stuff. I'm going to rinse that gooey, gooey out before eating it. That's just my preference. And then I'm going to do this other one. Look at that. Look at that. This is just like hidden fruit all through here. These things are huge when you see them in the market. They're like 20 pounds a lot of times. They're huge, but they're so meaty. I could see them filling you up really quickly. This is a sweet honeydew melon that I'm about to try out today. 
Um, I usually don't eat honeydew, so this is going to be a trial. Let's see if I like it. So I just scooped out the seeds to clean it out, and I'm going to slice this up and give it a try. Let's see if me and the baby like it. So this is what, it's a pretty large container. I'm about to eat this because I haven't eaten yet, and it's about lunchtime, so this will be like partial breakfast. This is brunch. That's what this will be. Get this going. 